Let's now add ink. The operation of adding ink is very simple. We only need to strictly follow the color identification to add ink, and add the corresponding ink according to the identification affixed to the machine, and the identification on the ink tube. Dot K equals black, C equals cyan, M equals red, Y equals yellow, low, W equals white, V equals varnish. Varnish is a semi-transparent liquid. When adding ink and extracting ink cartridges, we need to turn off the main power supply or unplug the power cord in advance. Cover the syringe with an orange needle. After adding ink, we will extract the ink from the ink cartridge. It is important to extract all the air from the ink cartridge and pipeline and extract 5 ml of ink. Please note that when holding ink bags, we should hold both sides of the ink bags and avoid squeezing the middle. After extracting 5 ml ink, we will insert the ink cartridge into its original position and prohibit pulling out all ink cartridges at once. When extracting the next ink cartridge, please pay attention to cleaning the orange syringe with a tissue or dust-free cloth. The same technique is used, extracting 5 ml of ink and inserting it into its original position. The extracted ink cannot be reused. Please treat it as waste ink. Due to time constraints, I will only demonstrate extracting two ink bags. You need to strictly extract 510 ml of ink from all ink cartridges, and insert each ink cartridge into its original position thank you. Now that we have extracted the ink bags, we need to power them on, and start them up. Before extracting the ink from the waste ink tube, we observe these two details. X is in a state of zero, and the device displays a ready state. This is the correct state to extract the waste ink. If X is not a state of zero, it means that the ink card has not returned to the original point for resetting. Please click on X reset to return the ink card to point zero. The machine will have two waste ink pipes, and we need to strictly and slowly extract one zero ml of waste ink. Let's go to the software to automatically clean the print head. Automatically clean all print heads on the software. During the cleaning process, the printer control icon is dimmed and will be restored after cleaning is completed. After cleaning the print head, we will print the nozzle status diagram and press the test button on the control panel to proceed. After receiving this command, the machine will print a status map of the print head. After printing is completed, the ink truck will return to the original point for resetting. Now let's take a closer look at the status diagram. Please send the printed status diagram to the technical personnel for viewing to see if it is qualified thank you. This is a close up of the print head status chart. When we look at the status chart, we make a judgment based on its line chart situation. The standard good state is that the line chart has no broken needles or cross colors. The line diagram of varnish is difficult to view in CL, ear, and requires backlighting for observation. The status chart is the inkjet report of the print head, and we must maintain a daily status report to pay attention to the ink output status of the print head. Thank you for watching. See you next class.